Today we're back with another Amazon customer return knife box. You say a what? I said a knife. Like you mean a knife? A knife box. A knife box. A knife. I'm sorry. I understand now. A knife box. That's right. There could be things from like the fun knife. There could be military style knives, hunting knives. There could be paring knives, gardening knives. But all in all, our goal is to at least find one knife for me to keep for business use. That's our goal. That's our goal. At least find one knife that I like. I'm actually show the camera first. You see anything probable in there? There's another buck knife. So we'll go through this. Oh, there's a sog. Oh, nice. No. That's a, ooh, that's mine. Ooh, no it's not. We have a SOG fixed blade seal strike knife. This is a SOG. I don't have a SOG knife. That's fun. Well, this buck knife doesn't sell for very much. What does it look like? $25. Pull it out. Nice. Oh, sweet. That's a SOG. Kind of, it's like-ish a K-Bar. Sog Seal Strike with an incredible holster on there. I learned a lot about these buck knives. There's like this logo label on here that tells you exactly the date as to when, what year this knife was manufactured. Really? Yeah. On buck knives? Yeah. On just buck knives though? Well, yeah. I mean, it's the buck knife logo. So it has a symbol on the blade of each knife. And you go to Buck, and it'll tell you the year that it was made. And some of the older, more vintage are more expensive, depending upon which knife it is. So huh. that's how you know whether you're getting a vintage knife. Vintage, but probably made a little bit better, too. Or <laughs> you're getting a more modernized knife. I actually do have one Buck knife in my knife collection. I have one Buck knife. Actually, it was sent to me from a viewer. They sent me a buck knife. Actually, that's the one I use upstairs in those videos. How much, how much did that buck, buck knife $25. sell for $25? That's not bad. We have the Smith & Wesson knife here. $66 for the SOG. Oh. Do I need to keep it? No. I don't really need a SOG knife. I do like it, though. It is pretty freaking so nice. This is a Smith & Wesson, like, I don't know what you like call this. Like a boot knife. Yeah. Yeah, the boot knife. That's a yeah, good name see, for it. Like it clips, boot it knife. clips in, into your boot, too. That's a great name for it. But it is a boot knife. I know. Did you already... I was being silly. You're being fastidious. Somebody's going to get upset at you for saying that word that way. What's that word mean again? I always forget. Yeah. It means you're being kind of sarcastic. You're not... So you were being fastidious. <laughs> Actually, you can't even say it. That's only thirteen dollar knife. Thirteen dollar boot knife. It actually it is called a boot knife too. It's called a so. boot knife too. So we're not being fastidious. Oh, this one I just sold this brand. Ooh, how much? Fifty bucks. Fifty bucks. I did. I just sold it. I don't know if this is the same knife. It's like a little baby it is, knife. I think it is the same knife I just sold. Why well, it's hard hard to read. Prout cutlery. Looks like a super cheap knife, like crazy cheap quality. So I scanned this one and it appears whoever returned it, they returned a different knife in the box. Oops. It retails for 35, but they returned something completely different. It's like a, a stream like cheapy knife. It's like cheap. I mean, it's cheap. Well, that, you can oh, literally- You can bend, bend the blade. You can bend the blade. Like, it's Yikes. cheap. It's this cheap. one, um, we actually have already sold this Ooh. exact one for 50 bucks. What's that look so, like? it, Do I need it? No, you don't need it. Let me, let me see it real fast. You don't need it. Hold on, just... You don't need it. It's a nice knife, and you don't need it. How much does it sell for? Ooh. For the third time, $50. Hold on. Pretty smooth. It's not as smooth as the other knife, though. Okay. okay. There you go, darling. What we got? I don't need it. We got a Farberware Edge Keeper. That's nice. Not really though. Oh, it's a knife sharpener. Oh, look at that. How much does the Farberware sell for you think? The barcode's covered up. 15 bucks. I'm gonna guess 15 bucks. <sighs> Sorry, I got sleepy for a minute. I guess our video was starting to bore you. <laughs> 
Wake up, darling. <laughs> so you, you can tell she is invested in this video. She's invested. Deeply invested. Yeah, it's like, it's like 15 bucks. <laughs> She's invested. Full tang survival knife. Wow. These usually sell pretty well. A full tang, too. Oh, yeah. Little survival little, knife. Little, little small knife. And it comes with a leather sheath as well. Look at that thing. This is a butter knife, like a big old butter knife. <laughs> that is, looks is it a cake knife? It almost looks like a cake knife, but it's not. Big old, big old knife, but it's only a big old butter knife. It doesn't look very sharp. <laughs> I'm gonna butter your buns. <laughs> yeah, I will. <laughs> I will butter your biscuit. Why is this not going back in here? Twenty-four dollars, and it is a Sierra. It's a bread knife. <laughs> you <literally laughs> butter your bread. <laughs> it is a bread knife. It says. That's you funny. are correct. Where's where's the I, where's the fancy stuff? I don't know. Here's some big. Ooh, got a mystery box. Some of these can be expensive, darling. Uh huh. Look at that. That's, that's pretty. This is cheap. This thing is like twenty bucks. That is not expensive at all for the two-o cutlery. Well, this survival knife, I don't think it's very much. I, I haven't found it, the exact one, but what I'm finding on this one is like 15 bucks. That's the same or brand we, we had earlier. The yeah, G, this, this one has that code. I that, don't think it's very expensive. These, I, I think that brand's a cheapy brand. The, these actually work now on Amazon to scan these now. No kidding. I did not know that. It worked in the previous videos I've been doing. Of course, is this it probably yours? won't work This now. is yours, right? Yeah, that's, that's my Kershaw. It can't scan this when there's something wrong with it. Anyway, but you can use a scan that, that thing now and it'll pull it up. This is another, that Albatross brand. We've had this in other knife boxes before and it's, it's just a cheapy brand. What is... It's very thin. Is that G? What's, what's the purpose w. of this? What do you do with that? Well, I am a knife collector, as they say. Okay, Mr. Knife Collector, what do you do with that? Well, you use that to kind of like, you keep the time like 2 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 10 o'clock, 12 o'clock, put up to the sun, it shines it down, and you say, oh, about 2.30. So how that works? I kind of thought it was like to trim your, or to brush your beard. No. No. It's kind of like a, a sundial. Oh. And I couldn't Makes find sense. I couldn't find this one on Amazon. It doesn't bring it up. It looks pretty cheap. So it's cheap. Two knives left. There's nothing in good value in this box. Uh -uh. Hopefully oh, this one has. Oh, another. It's that same Smith and Wesson knife that that game. Oh, ups. that this. It's like ten dollar knife. Yeah. It's cheapy. There's. Oh, the best knife was a SOG, which I kind of want to keep it, but I can't keep it now. Because uh -huh. there's nothing else of value in this box. There's, everything else is like $10, $20. Nothing of crazy value. Oh, this one's $70. Oh, let me see that. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I need this one. Ooh, it has a nice bag. Wow. A nice bag. It's a black bag with gold, like... How much is it? 70. Doesn't feel like a $70 knife. Feels kind of cheap. Well, that's what, <laughs> that's what it's going for. It feels feels kind of cheap. Hopefully it does sell for as close to that. I don't know, but there was not, I mean, this one was 50. This one was like 60. So we're still not at our money yet. Well, this one may be 70. Maybe, maybe, or maybe. Oh, we'll say 50. 30, 40. 40. <laughs> so we're at... This one will sell very quickly. This SOG, that's actually a good knife. So these three right here... Should pay for should it. Should pay for it. And then the rest, the rest are just kind of like... 10 and $20 knives. Yeah. So this might be a double up. Maybe... I don't know if we we'll get I don't 300 even, back. No, I don't, I don't even know. think we'll get 300 back. This is probably going to be a close to make your money back. Maybe, oh. I mean, but you have to think about it. After we pay taxes on it, after we pay eBay fees, 
any other fees that come along, yeah. we will probably come close to breaking even on this. Yeah, this was not not the best box. This mm -hmm. wasn't a wow kind of box. Not a wow box. A wow. Did not wow. Wow. But it was still fun. Once again, I'm keeping no knives from this box because I've already got enough knives. and This is his also. I don't really need a knife from this box either. No. I, I have to kind of pace myself when it comes to knives. Pace myself. I, I don't need every knife. Good job. I'm proud of you. I am a knife collector. You are maturing. I appreciate that. <laughs> Look. <laughs> You're like, you're a dork. You were so smooth. You didn't even see that, did you? You're a dork. That's all we got this time. We do have some more knife boxes left, but I might take a few before you see another one. Just kind of chill out on the knives for a little bit. But this still was fun. The SOG is a nice knife, but I won't keep it. I do need it, but I won't keep it. More than likely. So, we'll see you next time. We upload this channel every single day. Go down there, hit that subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.